happy birthday as well. You always find the latest courtyard. And in solution, Kate. In out of the box. Hello and welcome to our Radio Waves by Todd Herbert. If you enjoy reviews, comparisons, band scans of new and classic portable radios, then make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss any of my most excellent videos. In front of us, we have the Sanjin PRD19. This is an AM FM portable radio, stereo, and we're going to perform a daytime medium wave band scan or it features the radio, a little size comparison, and we'll start cruising the daytime band. So let's check it out, the Sanjin PRD-19. Amazing radio. Actually very selective on FM and AM. Uh, really impressed with this radio. You may have seen other videos of mine featuring the D-19 and FM e-skips during the summertime, where I set it up and I have it recording 24-7, uh, looking for elusive e-skips that bounce around the atmosphere, and sometimes going up to 1,300 miles. It's pretty amazing around June and July, as we'll be doing again next year. Uh, we'll see some more of those videos. So let's go ahead and look at features. Left-hand side, we have an auxiliary in, which I haven't used, but I forgot this radio had it, so that's kind of cool. I have a Wi-Fi radio I might hook up to it because this is stereo. Probably have some good audio to it. Our headphone jack, a DC input, 6 volts, 1 amp. There's your polarity. Sleeve negative, positive pull terminal. Nice. Front of the radio, I'll just kind of set this down. You can see the twin speakers. I took this radio apart, very well made. I'm very impressed with the internals. Um, it is an awesome product inside and out. And yeah, it's, it's just absolutely amazing. The audio sounds fantastic. LCD display, it lights up with a white light. You'll get to see in a little bit. Right now it's showing a 12 hour clock. It's 11.01 a.m. Central Standard Time near Chicago, Illinois. We're about four, four and a half hours after sunrise, and we about five hours to sunset. So here you got some buttons. We have a wake to alarm and wake to radio. Uh, they have a humane wake system, so it doesn't like just blurt <laughs> at the alarm. It slowly gets louder. It's always a nice thing. Uh, here with the band select button and bandwidth control, so if you're in the FM, you can narrow it and also on the AM band. It's kind of nice. There's a little green writing. I don't know if you can see that. Let me get up close. It says step. You can change the step also on the uh, 9K, 10K AM, and an FM, I believe it's 50 kilohertz to 100 kilohertz. You do that when the power is off. We have a LED that turns green when the power is on. Power button, sleep function, tuning up and down, or seek up and down, pretty simple. Uh, over here we have a display button. Uh, we have mono, uh, so set the FM stereo to mono, which is kind of nice because you have the two speakers. And then below that, I think it says time set. Yep, so you can set the clock. And of course, over here, we have volume controls up and down. Or, yeah, down and up. <laughs> I'll get that right. D19. Uh, right hand side, nothing. Bottom, nothing. But the top's kind of cool. We have five preset buttons. Yep, those work. It's pretty cool. Uh, you have five presets. Uh, you actually have 10 total on AM and 10 total on FM. You split it into two bands of FM and two bands of AM. You'll probably see that when I'm turning the radio on. Uh, here's our antenna, swivels. Pretty nice. It's got this rubber jacket all the way around. On the back side of the radio, we have some band information. There's your frequency ranges, 9K, 10K. There's the FM. Okay, pretty standard. Serial number. Uh, really neat. Okay, there's your lockout switch. I really like that. That's recessed right there. Nice. And then we have our battery compartment, which is really easy to open. Capture door. And as you can see, it takes four AA batteries. And I'm using rechargeables. This radio will go through those batteries pretty quickly because it's a pretty powerful sounding radio with the two speakers. But there you go, EBL 2800s. Nice cells. I'll have a link in the description down below for the radio. It's an awesome radio. Check it out. I watch for sale prices. These batteries are really good too. So if you're looking for a good rechargeable on the cheap, the EBL does it really nice. If you don't want to spend money on Enloop Pros or regular Enloops. So there you are. Okay, so let's do a little size comparison and we'll start cruising the daytime band. Okay, what do we got? We got CC Pocket. <laughs> Just going to leave it in frame like that. You get an idea. Um, CC Pocket is a little AM FM weather radio. Pretty cool. Okay, you get an idea. Awesome. And then next we have CC Skyway. We'll just kind of set that in the middle. Give you an idea. I use my Skyway all the time. 
even with this tinny speaker, but it has a headphone jack. I use that too. And then we have Iron Man. He's the man with the master plan. He loves engines from China land. He's Iron Man. Wow. <laughs> he does look Asian kind of in that. Uh, maybe, yeah. <laughs> All right. Left tangent. So let's go ahead and start this up. I have a Turk Advantage loop to my left uh, for daytime stations of faint. I'm not sure. I can't remember if this does well with a loop or not. We'll find out. So let's go ahead and turn it on. Okay. Battery level indicator. Band we're on. Frequency. And then there's our bandwidth. Typically, you leave it wide. Narrow. It really gets really low. So I tend to leave it on the wide setting. There we go. We'll get a faint station see if it helps. So we'll cruise up the band. At home with a full roster. Like Clayton Myron. Uh-uh. Yeah. I'm out. I'm out. And now you're talking about you've got to win a game. Okay, here's 540 WAUK Jackson, Wisconsin. ESPN Radio. Now, I have done a band scan before with this radio. You can check it out. It was two years ago. I figured I'd do a little refresher on this radio after two years. The color changes with that LED, LCD, that white LED. Uh, but uh, yeah, we're doing that. Also, I want to attention uh, the detail here. There's a ferrite bar antenna that runs along this area right here. It's a horizontal ferrite antenna. It's for the AM band. And then this, this one here is for the FM band. People don't know that. It's a very beginner thing, but I like to say that, say that in every one of my medium wave band scans or AM band scans. But that internal antenna is pretty cool. And what it is, it's a coil of wire and it receives your medium wave broadcast because the wavelength is very long and it needs a special antenna. And it's oriented this way and it's the horizontal edge. And when you have a station that's either north or south, you want to face a horizontal edge to that direction. So right now, it's picking up north stations and south stations. And of course, that's west and that's east, to give you an idea. But it gets better when I turn it to the right direction. As you can hear, it almost, the station disappears. So there we go. Keep going. So on the tie-breaking vote. I think I didn't. Okay, 560 WIND, Chicago, Illinois. The answer? So I, 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 Dennis Prager. I have new Pizans. I used to say Pizan pneumonia or ADR. Now it's, uh, I had a new one the other day. P, P as in. That's psychology. Anyway. I guess nowadays we call it color switching, right? He grew up in Chicago, but when he went to Southern Illinois, he sometimes deployed a drawl. And we have another, just another little bit of tape. Let's listen to this NPR report from. W-I-L-L, an NPR station out of Urbana, Illinois. It's about 150 miles away. Coming in pretty good. You can bring a loop in and see if it gets any louder. He became a superbly successful campaigner with a trial lawyer's instinct for immersing himself in the idiom of his audience. Addressing a revival meeting in Southern Illinois, replete with Southern accent. Too much of that kind of promising politics. Promise us a road, promise us a lake, promise us a bridge, promise us a dam. Oh, just a promise little us bit. Everything. Promise what you think we want to hear. And then never... Here's a 590 WKZO, Kalamazoo, Michigan. Uh, this one is going to, I think, 140 miles away. Let's bring a loop in. If it helps. Oh, well, pay, 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 that's awesome. <laughs> it's like, no, no, it's coming. It's, yeah. it's coming in September, and you're going to have to pay them all and catch them all up, or they're going to do this thing called foreclosure. Yep, we brought a bank. Get some nice gain in there. Nice. It's like free power, which is nice. Okay, this is cool. This is WMT, Cedar Rapids, Iowa, on 600. And this is uh, 175 miles. In got 1999, 2000, we decided to move. Well, we actually we outgrew that building. I guess I could help on a very faint station. And started looking, found a piece of property here on Blair's Ferry, mm -hmm. and. Uh, it I am. Well, 
Rising with the sun. Okay, this is 620 WTMJ, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Yes, so... WMFN, Piatone, Illinois. La indígena y número tres, la española. Si combinas estos tres ritmos, te da. Disappointed in the coaching in the first half. I thought the game plan was absurd. It, it felt to me like they decided, okay, this has been fun for four weeks. Now let's go back to what wasn't working, and it didn't work. Here's 670, the score, WSCR, Chicago. Um, if you notice, it says M1, that is the preset up here. So if I go to 2, 720, go back to 1. It's pretty nice, quick presets. Uh, only thing is, when you're carrying the radio, <laughs> And you carry from the top while it's on, you'll bump those, and if it's not locked on the back, it'll change. It's pretty funny. I've done it. All right, so let's go keep going. Seven hundred. Let's see if we can pick up seven hundred. I hear something. This is uh, WLW, Cincinnati, Ohio, three hundred miles away. Barely hear some voices. It's probably not coming in the microphone. Let's see if the loop will bring it up. There we go. Really can't hear what they're saying, but. Oops, I switched the band. <laughs> All right. Hold that down. Okay, that's pretty cool. Well, we're in the uh, winter time, so typically uh, with short days, you will pick up these farther stations, which is nice. Um, it makes for uh, medium wave listening the best during the day. Okay, let's keep going. And you can go to my Facebook page, Elise Glank, over at Facebook.com. Feel free to share your good news I there. forgot I had it turned we'll up. some of these stories from there a little bit later 720 on WGN, Chicago. All right, we're going to take a short break. When we come back, I've asked Congressman Raja Krishnamurthy to talk about the stimulus package and COVID relief bill. We're going to talk about that and try and get to your questions. So feel free to text or call. This would be Zoomer Radio, Toronto, Ontario. I don't think we're going to be picking that up right now. Sometimes if I don't wait long enough to midday, I'll be picking it up in the morning and evening. You know, two hours before sunset and two hours after sunrise. Seven fifty WNDZ, Portage, Indiana. I kind of wish would make this radio perfect as an analog volume control. I'm not a fan of the digital buttons on the front. Same with the tuning. It would be cool to have a normal tuning. Okay, that might come in. Let's see if we can get this here. This is Detroit, Michigan. Got to turn it up. There it is. Seven sixty WGR Detroit, Michigan, two hundred and seventy miles. Weather's Bob Martison on Chicago's weather station. News radio seven eighty. 
I'm definitely going to edit that audio <laughs> so we don't blow any eardrums out. 780, <laughs> it's like I keep forgetting. 780 WBBM Chicago. Play fake, Mitch gonna throw. Pressure coming from behind. Loves it. Down the left side. Up in the air. Snag. Touchdown. Jimmy Graham. Touchdown, Bears. Falling backwards. Makes the grab. This sounds pretty Bears good. Love the audio. The Keep going here. Well, in traditional offline counseling and financial aid is available. Start living a happier life today. Uh, 820 WCPT, Willow Springs, Illinois. Dot com slash Tom. Okay, so we're picking up uh, WHAS Louisville, Kentucky on 840. Um, so yeah, I mean, this is definitely four and a half hours after sunrise. Let's bring the loop in. It's coming in strong. The EIB network has, but most mainstream news media is staying away from this because it makes President Trump look much more. Very cool. All right, nice, nice, nice. Good to hear. Okay, let's keep going. There's another faint station. We shouldn't be picking up Denver yet. <laughs> Okay, this music is in Milwaukee, WNOV, um, it's a 250 watt station, uh, 52 miles away. It's really nice, and it's uh, yeah, north-south orientation, so there's music playing, can't hover on it. There you go, nice. September of 2018 connects with the report I'm holding in my... Here's WLS, Chicago, Illinois. I wish I could do one kilohertz stepping to get away from that high pitch whine from my camera, but it does not have one kilohertz stepping, if you guys are wondering. So no fine tuning, but it does well enough. It picks up a little bit from the stronger stations below it and above it, but during the evening you don't get that. This is Detroit, Michigan. WFDF. 270 miles, 25,000 watts. Patrick Mahomes good. Yeah, there were two drives in the whole game that decided the division. Russell at the end of the first half, Russell at the end of the game. WOKY, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Drives the whole football game for Buck and Aikman, and Russell had both. I mean, I can't. Walker Law Firm works to assure that assets are passed down to loved ones. More information is available. 930 WBKM, Sandwich, Illinois. I'm going to go a little faster here so we get to the band. 847 274 Oldies 94 WFAW. So we got oldies on WFAW 940 Fort Atkinson, Wisconsin. Sweet. Inspire more hope filled stories by making a year end donation today. WNTV Chicago. Give today. Relevant Radio. On your 2020 taxes. Donate at relevantradio.com. Or the relevant radio. He said it twice. <laughs> the relevant radio studio line. <laughs> Three is times. By Catholic Order of Foresters. <laughs> Information about employment opportunities and their flexible premium life. Nice. <laughs> In case you didn't get the first couple times. A professor at Bemidji State University, where he leads. W H A Madison, Wisconsin. Uh, revitalization Sound good. Efforts. He's the author of the Language Warriors Manifesto: How to Keep Our Languages Alive, No Matter the. Turn this down. Or higher, dial star star one one five seven on your mobile phone right now to see if your car qualifies. So ESPN one thousand WMVP Chicago. WNVR Vernon Hills Illinois. Man, I gotta really keep moving here. <laughs> There's so many stations. 
have a good one. Two six two six nine four ten fifty. Hi, there's Sonny on there. We talk. Whoa, what was that? Hello. <laughs> Hello. Where? WLIP Kenosha, Wisconsin. It's cool. They got cool radio shows on the weekend. Uh, let's see. WHFB Benton Harbor, Michigan. Let's see if we can get this in. Ninety-five miles away. Just barely picking that up. Keep going. I mean, you can quote that. You can do what you want to do with it. But at the end of the day, I believe in these guys. I believe in this. this uh, WTSO, said. Madison, Wisconsin, on 1070. Weakness to a strength in all Seattle's big gambles. Russ, Pete's contract. Got some music there. Uh, WNWI, Oak Lawn, Illinois. WMBI, Chicago, Illinois. Okay, something's going on there. Provided for you free of charge by your state government to help every newborn child develop. Okay, WISN, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, 1130. They're listening to classics. Our election yeah. today. So I, I have this question for Harry, and that is this from a legal standpoint. I mean, this is great. I'm glad that they're they're now putting some voter. It's all this is. is Here's W Y L L, Chicago, it's Illinois. When it comes to a presidential election, this is, should have been exactly what was being put in place. Let's see if the squirrel shows up. 1180. All right, the squirrels here, yeah. <laughs> WSQR, Sycamore, Illinois. Uh, squirrels in your neighborhood or something like that. <laughs> I love it. Sweet. Yeah, it sounds really good, real punchy on here. Esa es la mentalidad de nosotros, ¿no? Porque... Sounds even better on FM, of course, but awesome for AM, too. Uh, WRTO, Chicago, Illinois. I got a crank here. Okay, that sounded bad. <laughs> I got to tune faster. Uh, WKRS, Waukegan, Illinois. You're talking about WCLO, Janesville, Wisconsin. We see wide uh, changes in prices, but that's. WSBC, Chicago, Illinois. Sounds like a computer game or something. 1250, uh. Jeez, uh, it's Milwaukee. WSSP. Okay, cool. Didn't have it written down. Here's WEKZ, Monroe, Wisconsin, 60 miles away. This is today's Midwest Digest, with news and commentary from across the heartland of America. Today's Midwest... Okay. I'm not sure it's on 1270 if I figure it out. I'll put it here. WBIG, Aurora, Illinois. coming in good wzti greenfield wisconsin um the fans yeah they got some cool classic music a lot of music stations wrdz lagrange illinois that's something else i had to deal with so you think you're out of top where you guys WIBA, Madison, Wisconsin. Report open, and then we are going. Trubisky down on the edge, 
Uh, Pierce has been another guy that they've used occasionally. 1330 WNTA, Rockford, Illinois. They've used some guys in different ways. A couple stations mixing. WJYI, Milwaukee. And WJOL, Juliet, Illinois. So, yeah, that's a little fun to always try to decode. WLBK, DeKalb, Illinois. Category for that, nothing happened there. And RV and campers, guess what? Nothing to that as well. So, again, things were open awfully lean here in the mypeepost.net. There is a special category too for miscellaneous. Net. Solid selling stuff on the radio. Love it. Uh oh. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Can't hover. 1380 WBEL, South Beloit, Illinois. <laughs> it's karaoke time. Daughter Bert. <laughs> okay, uh, so that was WBEL, South Beloit. I don't know if I said it. I think it did. 1380. This is 1390 WGRB, Chicago, Illinois. Gospel music, as you can tell. WRJN, Racine, Wisconsin. Usually music, but they're doing some talk right now. Both gentlemen come from the north. That is an Altoid. Yep. So we've got B8. And again, what are you guys using? Altoid, curiously strong men. WRMN, Elgin, Illinois. You know what's fun with Altoids? Is you take one when you're wearing a mask, and your sinuses will be cleared out like it was nobody's business. That's what you're saying. Because all of your exhales. 1420, picking something up. Okay, if I can figure that out, I'll post it. Cool. There's WEEF, Deerfield, Illinois. Awesome. Man, I'm gonna keep going quicker. Holy cow! So we we not only support America, we drive America. WROK, Rockford, Illinois. When you start looking at the minutia. WCEV, Cicero, Illinois. Iron Country, WGEZ, Beloit, Wisconsin. Sounding good. Okay, we got Rebel Radio, WPJX, Zion, Illinois. Heavy metal on AM. Love it. Music there, 1520 WLUV, Love Spark, Illinois. Yeah, kind of, it's the genre I like. My dad listened to that, so you know how you're, you know, the kids like to listen to it. So yeah, I kind of picked up on my dad's music. Pretty cool stuff. Okay, 1530 WCKG, Elmer, Illinois. Country music on 1570. I'll post it. I, don't, I gotta start writing this stuff down on my daytime list. <laughs> Country music. Sweet. 1580 WTTN, Watertown, Wisconsin. Going quicker. WCGO, Evanston, Illinois. Don't know what he's saying. Okay. 
This will be Toronto. Not coming in. Okay. Lake County's Traffic Advisory Radio, 1620. WSJP, Sussex, Wisconsin, and two more stations, and we're done. It's not. Some of the most historic farms here in Wisconsin. For this story, we're going to. WOZN, Madison, Wisconsin, the zone. family farm is 103. Control over it, but we'll pray for you. See you tomorrow. WBON, Chicago. Okay, I think we're done. All right, let's go ahead and turn this off. Final thoughts on the Sanjin PR D19. Whoop, the band scan for the daytime. Amazing radio. Um, I can't fault it. Everybody that's bought one of these PD, uh, PR D19s has loved it. Uh, so if you don't have one yet and it's a decent price, go pick it up. Go check out the links. Support the channel. Uh, enjoy a great radio. Um, just a fun radio. You may have to buy the AC adapter. I have another Sanjin radio. I think it's one with the USB that goes on top. Uh, I can't remember the mile number. If I remember, I'll put the mile number here comes with the same power supply. So I've been using that one to power this radio. So I didn't have to buy it, which is great, but I had to buy that radio. <laughs> so I don't expect you to go buy a radio for the power supply, but if you want to run it all the time, power supply is nice or use rechargeables like I'm doing. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, give a big like. You guys are the best. Uh, two, if you love Sanjin radios and you love the reviews and the band scans and comparisons, hit subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified of future videos. And of course, three, comment below what you think about the PRD19 during the daytime. Do you have this radio? Do you love it? Let me know. Like I said, I haven't had anybody complain about this radio. All right, guys, take care, and we'll see you in my next video.